a city of angels with the palm trees I see the lights, camera actions all around me I'm trying to win now, they used to doubt me I'm trying to win now, they used to doubt me Cause I'm in LA with it, for the vibes I got a Californian tea up on the ride They ask me how I'm living, I'm living right, yeah Now is you with me cause there ain't no special size, yeah Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good day. John Lopez UK is today, and today I'm showcasing this. This is uh, from an OCRP pack in GTA 5M, and um, the vehicles are pretty good. So these come in four different cars, and um, let me just showcase all of them. Bear in mind, these aren't the best modeled, and the deliveries aren't the best, so there are some slight problems here and there. But besides that, the pack is great. All right, let me just showcase everything. So. Starting off with all the basics, uh, extra one is a go rhino push bar with the police mounted to it. You have the full, uh, what is it? It's the headlight wraparounds, and then you have the bumper wraparounds if you need those as well. Then you have all the police lights. Now the Dodge Charger in this model, this one on this server has the wrong number mounted to it, so it's it the lighting doesn't work, and it is, it'll be glitched here and there. So I'm not going to have the lights on for this one, but I'll showcase everything. You have extra five, which is a driver's side spotlight that does light up and work. You have a visor light bar that does uh, work, but the problem is it just doesn't work on this model. After that, it's a Valor, federal signal Valor light bar on the roof. And then you have this, which is the running board lights. It'll cause loads of problems, but if you ignore that, actually, I need to reload it. Yeah, but besides that, it's great. You have in rear, you have the uh, something from what I believe used to be Code 3. And then you have the window uh, cage on the passenger side, on the driver's side. And then extra 12 is the rear plate lights. You can get those if you want. Alright, so that's the 2018 Charger for everyone. Liveries don't really... Well, you have an unmarked livery if you want it, but that's only if you really want it. And uh, the lights do stay on if it has broken modeling, but that's fine. We'll move on to the next one. So the next one is PD CVPI. Um, it's a Crown Victoria Police Interceptor. Actually, without any lighting, this thing has no lighting. So everything works, but it just doesn't have any extra lighting to it. So yeah, uh, liveries, you have this in the unmarked livery if you want that. Extra one is the Centina PB. Yeah, Centino PB300 up front with the full HD wraparounds if you want. You have some grill lights up front, and then you have a uh, spotlight from Unity. How uh, Unity? Then you have the visor light bar, which does light up and work. I don't think there are takedowns. No, there aren't. You have a Valor light bar from Federal Signal up top. You have extra seven, which is some uh, lights mounted to the bottom of the car, and then you have. Extra 8, which is... What is extra 8? Oh, it's the... No. Yes, it is. It's... So, on the driver's side, it's the cage. And then you have extra 9, which is, I guarantee it's the... Yes, yeah, the passenger side. And then you have lights mounted to the rear of the car if you want those. And then you have ALPR cameras mounted to the boot. Uh, you have um, more antennas mounted to the boot if you'd like that as well. And that's all of the extras for the Crown Victoria. For, uh, I reckon the price of this one is free, but I could be wrong. But for the price, I'll say it's most likely going to be free. So after that is a 2016 FPIU. Keep in mind, this isn't the best modeled car, but it does get the job done. So extra one is a Western Pit Elite up front with the headlight wraparounds. And then you have the full uh, bottom wraparounds. All right, so after that, you have a... You have a spotlight mounted to the car, driver's side spotlight. You have the spec, uh, no, not the spectral, like something visor light bar. You have a full Valor light bar on the roof. You have the running board lights. You have some lights mounted to the, uh, between the C pillar and the D pillar windows. You have the Wayland outer edge mounted to the top. You have the plate lights. And then I reckon this is going to be, yep, prisoner cage on the passenger side and then on the driver's side. So overall, it's a very well done pack. The interior, I'm not actually sure if it's that detailed. 
It's not the most detailed, but it gets the job done. Right, let's move on to the next one, which is PD Impala, and it's going to be a last one. So the Impala isn't actually shown in most car packs, and actually it's not modeled as good as this one. This one's actually pretty nicely modeled, no additional lighting, but yeah. Liveries, you have a, you have, what is it? It's uh, unmarked, and you have marked. So in front, you have a Go Rhino, which is massive compared to the car itself. Then you have some lights on the Go Rhino, which I guess do work. Grill lights, if you don't want it, actually the push bar gets in the way of the grill lights. You have a driver's side spotlight, if you want that. You have roof mounted uh, lights, and then you have the Valor light bar. So it's a visor and the Valor, and then you have the running board lights. You have uh, the, rear li the mount lights mounted into the rear window in a GTA style, and then you have uh, prisoner cage on the passenger side, prisoner cage on the driver's side, extra 11 is going to be antennas mounted to the boot, and then you have the plate lights at the bottom, so that's the entire pack showcased, that's really it, um, it's just full car pack, it's, it's actually really good, for one thing, uh, if you remove any lighting on the vehicle that you really don't need and just leave on the spotlight, you could actually, you could actually pass this thing as a retired police car, like this. So it is a pretty good car pack if you do want retired police cars, because everything does work. I don't think the spotlights will rotate, no they won't, but everything's been done pretty well. Like I said, that's the end of the video, hope you guys enjoyed, uh, link is in the description below if you want to install it, and I'll catch you all next time, peace.